Okay, guys, welcome to your um, Twin Flame reading for Scorpio. This is going to be for your November 2024. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. So we are going to take a look and see how your Twin Flame journey is going with your Twin Flame. Apply this to your own unique situation. Switch the roles if you want. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post. Want to go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that is dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Also, if you guys are interested in wanting to uh, book a personal reading with me, the link for that is also in the description box below. All right, so messages for... Messages for... Um, Scorpio, what messages do we have here for Scorpio? When it comes to their twin flame journey, what their twin flame for November 2024, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Scorpio. Okay, so we have the Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Ten of Wands. Two of Cups. We have the High Priestess. Strength. And the Three of Cups. Okay, so how's your twin flame journey going with your twin flame here? Okay. I do feel like you're trying to release someone here and let someone go. I do feel like you're still trying to get back on your own two feet here. You're going out there meeting new people, okay? But, you know, I, I just feel like you guys haven't really given up on hope on finding love here. But there's also focus on working on yourself and working on building your intuition here or strengthening your intuition here at this time. Queen of Pentacles. And the Judgment card, Sagittarius Energy. The Ten of Wands, and also the Ten of Swords here. Okay? Yeah, it seems like you guys are definitely releasing some sort of painful betrayal that you went through here. Okay? Now, this could be with the Twin Flame. Maybe this is with the Soulmate here. You know, a, a, a prior relationship here. That's not a Twin Flame here. So, maybe you guys are still in a... In this place of looking for a twin flame or that you guys are not looking for a twin flame at all because some of you guys could have gotten rid of your twin flame yeah or separated from them two cups and also the ace of swords okay we have the high priestess and also the nine of pentacles the strength card and also the Lovers, Gemini Energy, Three of Cups, <clears throat> and the Hierophant, Taurus Energy. Okay. Yeah, I, I, I feel like you guys are looking for that soulmate energy or that twin, like I feel like you guys are more so looking for a soulmate here. You guys went through that twin flame situation here. You guys didn't really enjoy it here. And I feel like you guys are trying to find yourself. Trying to get back on your own two feet. Seems like you guys are going through some sort of soulmate awakening. Or that, you know, you might have awakened that, okay, you are dealing with the twin flame here. Or you were dealing with a twin flame here. But the situation's not working out. All right. What else do we have for, for Scorpio? What else does Scorpio need to know? Look out for, work on for November 2024. So we have the Page of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. We have the Three of Pentacles. Ace of Swords and the Justice card. And the Sun. Five of Cups, and also the Page of Wands, Aries, Little Side of Cherry's Energy. Mm 
It does seem like Summer here is coming back around with an apology here too. Yeah. However this is, Summer here is realizing that you are their happiness here. And I feel like Summer here wants to work things out here with you. I mean, this could be a twin flame that you separated from, that you, um, that, uh, that where they betrayed you here. Whoever this is, I feel like this person is very immature. This person's not on the same wavelength as you. And I just feel like you realize that you had to get out here because I just feel like you feel, or you felt very overwhelmed. You felt burdened by the situation here. Okay, you felt hurt basically. Yeah, and I feel like you're trying to choose, you're trying to find, you know, you're trying to look for someone here or that you're realizing that you have standards here that you want in a relationship or in your partner here. And I just feel like you're realizing that it's not this person because they don't check off all the boxes here. The Page of Cups and the Seven of Pentacles. Three of Pentacles and the Knight of Wands, Aries, Gil, Sagittarius energy. Yeah, it seems like someone here is realizing their mistakes here too. I mean, someone here could also themselves be going through some sort of twin flame awakening here. Whoever this is, there is definitely a fear of losing you here. Now, if there has been lies, deception here, okay? I do feel like this person, whoever this is, this person wants to come clean. This person wants to put everything out on the table here, okay? This person wants to tell the truth, all right? So, you know, the sun is basically exposing what's hidden with the moon card. And also, it's clarifying the justice card here. So, something's being revealed here. The sun. The ten of cups. Yeah, there's someone here that wants happily ever after here with you, Scorpio. The Five of Cups here. Here's the thing. Um, I really don't feel like this person has really matured here. Um, I do feel like, you know, whatever this person has done to you, I do feel like this person will do it again here. Yeah, this person hasn't really ha taken, really taken the time to really introspect and self-reflect here. And some of you guys could be coming to a realization of that with the World card here. You're just going to end things for good here. Yeah, you're just going to end things for good here. It's kind of like, okay... Perhaps we'll meet up in another, another lifetime and hopefully you will have your shit together. You, you know, so I feel like in this lifetime here, I don't feel like your twin flame is in that energy or has that capacity to really truly work on themselves here and heal. Okay. It's almost like I feel like, you know, when it comes to this connection here, you're on your own. You know, you're on your own to fend for yourself. Um... Yeah, there's just a lot of games here, okay? And I feel like you're drawing the line in the sand with this person here because I feel like this person has really truly hurt you over and over and over and over again here. Put you in third-party situations, all right? So, Scorpio, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like, share, subscribe. Hit the notification bell, and I will speak to you guys in the next one here. All right, thanks, guys. Bye.